With the season opening race of 2022 just a few days away, all the riders will be hoping to get off to a great start. This is especially true for Marc Marquez, who has been mostly on the sidelines over the last two years. He has now spoken to EFE about his expectations for this season. I'm your host, Dylan Shelley, and first up on Moto World, Marc Marquez knows his target sounds arrogant. Marc began by explaining why he is mentally stronger. Mentally, I am getting stronger and stronger. Now I am having fun. When you enjoy everything, everything becomes more pleasant, easier. After having spent two years practically injured, even competing last year and still winning three races, being able to start enjoying it mentally gives you an energy that is like having trained for three months from a physical point of view. He then revealed his goals for 2022. I would like to see myself at the top, otherwise I would be deceiving you. He summed up his words by conceding that it might sound arrogant, but explained how this thought process isn't something that is unique to him. Even though I put pressure on myself, and even though it may sound arrogant, but whoever you ask, be it my teammate or any rider, before you start a season, you have to aim for everything. Where would I like to see myself? At the top. Fast feed. Grassini Racing's Anea Bastianini stated that he is super ready. Testing was very good, and as a team, they are gelling very well together. I like the Qatari track, and I did quite well in my MotoGP debut last year. We have more experience now, so it's time to stop talking and start racing. My physical preparation went very well, and I felt the bike as my own since the first day in Malaysia. RNF Yamaha's Andrea De Vizioso is really happy and can't wait to go to Qatar. The La Salle International Circuit is an absolutely nice track, and I have very good memories there from recent years. Suzuki's Alex Rins thinks that one of the things that has improved and that they have tried in the last preseason test was the engine. They gave us a new engine and I think we took a small step forward. It's never enough, we always want more. I'll try to enjoy every Grand Prix. The first race is in Qatar. Let's go there and enjoy. His teammate Joan Mir feels that his 2020 title has the value it has. I won't value it again. The only thing that matters is winning more to demonstrate more to me, to all the people. Nothing was by chance. Winning a title makes you more hungry. It's not enough for you to stay in third. You want more. Grassini Racing's Fabio Di Genantonio pointed out that the Qatar Grand Prix will be the race of the year and the first MotoGP race of his career. I must admit that the last month has been quite complicated fitness-wise as I've had some issues that affected me. But then I was able to work well, so we'll be ready. The realistic goal is to continue to learn and grow. The optimistic one is to score my first points. Is it arrogant for Marc Marquez to aim to be at the top in 2022? Head over to my community page to vote in the poll and let me know what you think in the comments. And if you liked this video, feel free to subscribe and check out my others for all the latest in the world of MotoGP.